Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I have this quick and easy girls night out look for you all that I wore out to the city one night with a few of my friends so I thought that I'd recreate it for you all for today. Starting off with my MAC Prep and Prime Natural Radiance in the yellow shade, I'm just going to be applying that to my face. Now using this L'Oreal Blur Cream, I'm just going to be applying that to where my pores are most prominent. Taking this EX1 in Busywear foundation, I'm just going to be applying that all over my face. I absolutely adore this foundation, it is so so good. And now I'm just going to be doing my normal brow routine. I have filmed this before, so I will just link that down below. Using the Benefit Stay Don't Stray, I'm just going to be applying that underneath my eyes. This is an eyeshadow primer, but it is tinted and I think it offers enough coverage to be an under eye concealer and I absolutely love it. Taking this Jumbo Eye Pencil by Milani in the shade Champagne Toast, I'm just going to be applying this to my eyelids. Now I felt like being super glowy, so I'm going to be using the NARS Liquid Illuminator in the shade Coco Cabana just on the tops of my cheekbones and the high points of my face. Now for my favourite palette, I think of all time, this is the Too Faced Chocolate Bar palette. It just has the most amazing colours in it that I could ever imagine. Taking this matte peachy brown colour, I'm just going to be applying that to my crease just as a transition colour and making sure that everything is blended in seamlessly. Now I'm just going to be taking this cream colour to highlight my brow bone. Now using this slightly darker, slightly more neutral brown, I'm just going to be applying that to the outer corners of my eye just to give my eye a bit more definition. Now I'm going to be using this rustic gold colour which I think complements my dress amazingly. I'm just going to be applying this to the first half of my eye. Now taking this gorgeous maroon colour, it has the tiniest bit of sparkle in it. I'm just going to be applying that to the outer corner of my eye and making sure that it's blended into that rustic gold seamlessly. Using probably my favourite under eye setting powder, this is the MAC Pro Powder in the shade Emphasize. I'm just putting that underneath my eyes and wherever I put that liquid highlighter. Now to set the rest of my foundation, I'm just going to be using the MAC Studio Fix Powder. Now taking my Rimmel Scandalize Cole Kajal Eyeliner Pencil in the shade Brown, I'm just going to be applying that to my lower lash line. And then I'm just going to be smudging it out just a little bit with my finger. This colour is so, so, so beautiful. It is like a matte colour with all this shimmer in it. And I'm just going to be applying that to my lower lash line just super lightly just to set that liner into place. As with any step, this step is also optional. I'm just going to be using this plumping lip gloss by NYX and applying that to my lips. Using my Bronze Booster by Physicians Formula, I'm just going to be applying this where I normally bronze my face. Taking another MAC Pro Powder, this one's in the shade Sculpt, I'm just going to be sculpting out my cheekbones. I was going to use this Revlon Balm Stain, but I really didn't like how the colour kind of clashed with the eyes, so I did put a different colour on top of that. 
and the color that I ended up going with was the Astralis Velour Lips in the shade Paris. I absolutely adore this nude lip cream. It is so, so gorgeous. And if you can get it, seriously, buy it. It is the most beautiful thing ever. Now I'm just going to apply a few coats of mascara. This one is the Falsies by Maybelline. Now, of course, you can just leave it at mascara, but I decided to stick on fake eyelashes. These are the 523 by Red Cherry, and oh my goodness, guys, like, I have no idea what's up with Sydney weather, but my eyelashes literally felt like they were going to take flight and just fly away. Oh my god. This is the finished makeup look. I really, really like how it turned out. It was super, super easy and quick to achieve, and I really, really love it. Now for outfit, I decided to wear this black and red plaid dress and also this black and gold belt and I just loved how these two paired together just because the dress itself was just a little bit baggy so I needed something to give it a bit more structure. Then to tie in the gold on the belt, I decided to wear these black and gold shoes. I absolutely adore these. These are probably my most favourite shoes ever. And for hair, I decided to wear it natural like I do maybe 99% of the time. Okay guys, I hope you enjoyed watching me get ready for a girls night out. If you have a video like this, then definitely link it down below so I can watch it as well. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.